Hey guys and welcome. Recently was able to go out hunting and um, die cats hunting, not actual hunting, and I was able to find uh, a couple of items. Let's start with the first batch actually. Um, here, I'll start with my Indiana haul. I actually took a, a small road trip and um, I was able to find myself one of these. Which is awesome because I needed a couple more. It's pretty cool. I will do an unboxing video in a separate <laughs> separate video due to the reason why is I got to do the whole set for you guys. And um, really wasn't sure if I picked up the ground grinder. Um, wasn't one hundred percent sure, so I just grabbed one that I seen on the peg. Managed to find two more of these. Uh, three more. I have three total. Um, very much needed. Same thing with these explorers. I managed to find two more, which also is much needed. There's another one of those. Found myself a couple. Oh, actually, I found this one's an error. Hot Wheels Tesla. You can see up here. Kind of has. There's a little metal piece there. And I think I spotted one more thing. That was wrong with it. But I found that in a dump and that was uh, barely full. So they actually have a lot more Teslas. To, which is to my surprise. Um, something I didn't see over here. And I still am not seeing as many. Picked up myself a uh, 14 Corvette Stingray. In this beautiful yellow color. Very nice color. Uh, finally managed to find the... 69 Cadillac Sedan Devel. One of my uh, favorite models in the Matchbox Cadillac lineup. Um, Cadillacs are very nice, but I um, picked up two more of these. I'm thinking of making a Tesla dealership, so once um, the 2016 Teslas come in, I'm going to pick up a few of more of those. That way I can uh, get myself a little mini dealership for the town. And I finally managed to find it. It only took so long. But I finally found uh, the Tesla Model S. So I want to thank the state of, Illi state of Indiana for accepting someone from Illinois. <laughs> and um, I'm glad I was able to find these. Very nice haul overall. Um, couldn't ask for... I only went to two stores too. I only went to a Walmart and Meyer. Um, put those there. Take care of that for a later time. Uh, okay. Next, we look at Toyota. Oh, yeah, those are for Saturday's haul. That was a Friday's haul. Uh, managed to finally find a chicane treasure hunt. This is the first treasure hunt of 2015. I was missing it. And now I finally managed to find it. I probably seen it somewhere in the stores and didn't even catch it possibility um very nice treasure hunt and i'm only missing three treasure hunts to complete my 2015 treasure hunt list which for the first time ever i managed to even get that close next is rig storm uh, i only picked this one up because it glows in the dark and i thought you know what why not let me get one and so um 2016's uh rig storm is going to be a treasure hunt in b case i think or a case a case um it's very nice it's a very unique vehicle and uh, maybe one day i'll do a video on these if i find any more i might pick some more up these are pretty cool little race trucks pretty cool so i opened that one up that one, that one there all right now moving on to saturday morning um i get a text from a friend and says go to Toys R Us, Toys R Us, uh, Target. So I said, all right, you know what, I'll go. Found myself a uh, 1970, oh, I actually uh, got there right after they put the case up. So uh, 1970 Ford Escort RS 1600. It's a very nice color. Um, these aren't flying as much as the other one, but uh, it is what it is. I mean, it's a pretty nice model, very nice uh color change second variation 
Same thing with the uh, Ford Mustang GT Concept. Now we see it in white. Very nice sheriff's vehicle. This is uh, not a too bad looking Mustang. I only picked up one in one of those. And um, let's see. Now I picked up two Toyota off-road trucks. Reason why is I need some uh, race cars and race race vehicles, and I want to actually keep one box that will go with the uh, the super. I got the idea from uh, watching some people on YouTube trying to sell a regular variation with a super. So I said to myself, you know what? Why not? Why don't I have one and one? That way, one day I can show my kids, my grandkids. You know, this is what a super looks like, and this is what a treasure hunt looks like back in my day. And um, it's very nice to see uh, treasure hunts over the years. I actually recently just bought two old supers uh, just to have in my collection. And, uh, oh. and so here's the regular version, and here's the super version. I'm always excited to find them on the pegs. And, um, I don't know, you get a whole different feeling when you find it on the pegs than when you pull it out of your own box. But, uh, let me tell you, Monday I went to three, four targets technically, but I went to three in the morning. First one said they didn't have anything, and, uh, their shelves were pretty empty, and I don't know if they ever did get anything or not. But, um, they, uh, my friend said that there was supposed to be a case there. So the next two stores I went, uh, first store... The second store that I went to, um, the, the case was on a U-boat, and so I saw it and I just grabbed it, and I didn't even think about asking or anything, I just grabbed it, put them up, broke down the box, ended up putting it back on the pallet, that way the next person can take care of it, and um, no, no supers, that store. Next store, um... I found, found the pegs empty, so I asked an employee, and he went, and uh, he found it on a pallet, gave it to me, I put it up, I even put up the five packs for him, and uh, no super again, but I did manage to find a couple of treasure hunts, um, picked up two over here on Saturday, with the super, um, there were two cases that went up, only one super, but um, picked up two of these, and uh, one's going to be opened, the other one I'm going to keep boxed, and um, I'm going to open this one up here. I have uh, like two or three more of these, so I will give those, I will trade those with a friend of mine who needs one. And uh, it's pretty cool, very unique. Um, circle flame, same thing on the package right there. And yeah. So Saturday afternoon I actually went to the store to pick up a couple of items and um, so I decided to walk through and I found these next to each other and um, I don't know if you guys noticed this but look at the rear wheel, I got a rear wheel variation on the Enforcer, this one's H08 and this one's H07 so they started off with yellow before they went to green and um, I don't know how many of these were made, but it was pretty cool. Seeing both of them, I just grabbed them. I didn't realize until I was at the checkout when I looked back down to see what I got. And um, I saw that and I said, yep, that's awesome. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching this uh, video on a recent haul. I want to thank the people of Indiana for allowing me to finally find my Tesla Model S Matchbox model. And uh, my good friend who told me to go to Target. And so, yeah. See you guys next time. Hope you all have a wonderful day. And uh, enjoy yourselves. Don't work too hard. Bye-bye.